Hello, Raw folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of Raw news and analysis. But before we start, please make sure to subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon. Thanks. In the three years since their exit from the royal family, Prince Harry and his wife Meghan, Duchess of Sussex, have pursued their own careers, with ventures including deals with streaming giants, their own non-profit organizations, and the publication of books. However, a number of their most successful endeavors have been at the expense of their UK family members, with royal revelations and anecdotes largely seen as a huge contributing factor to their success and relevancy, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's most recent accusations against the royal family have led commentators to question what will come next for the couple, with some suggesting it's time to focus on non-war related projects. Channel 5 recently delved into the lives of Harry and Meghan, chronicling their journey from early romance to estranged royals. A documentary titled Harry and Meghan What's Next saw commentators speculate about what the future may hold for the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. Phil Dampier, author of Royally Suited, told the documentary, The Sussexes reportedly have other projects in the pipeline with Netflix, non-related to the royals, and I think that will be good for them, to concentrate on those for a while. Harry and Meghan signed the deal with Netflix, which was reportedly worth around £109 million or $142 dollars in 2020, just months after they stepped down from their royal duties and relocated to the US. While many expect the couple to play the role of producer in their upcoming projects, one commentator has speculated that both Harry and Meghan might choose to take on more front-facing functions. Simon Vigor, 5 News Royal Correspondent, suggested Meghan may return to her former career while Harry could embark on a new professional journey. I wonder whether Meghan will go back to acting, he told the documentary. That's the obvious thing for her. Harry could easily be a presenter of wildlife documentaries as he has the knowledge and he has the passion. On the other side, since signing the deal with Netflix, two projects have been released on the streaming platform. Harry and Meghan, a six-part documentary series about the couple's exit from royal life, and Live to Lead, a documentary focusing on the stories of inspirational leaders. But the first of several projects the couple were said to be working on was a documentary about the Invictus Games, which is set to spotlight a group of extraordinary Invictus Games competitors from around the globe, according to the Archwell website. And while Harry is expected to deliver documentaries about some of his greatest passions, Meghan may return to the world of scripted television. Speaking to Variety, the Duchess said, For scripted, we want to think about how we can evolve from that same space and do something fun. It doesn't always have to be serious. Like a good rom-com. Don't we miss them? I miss them so much. While Archwell Productions is yet to confirm any upcoming scripted content like Mr. Vigar, recent reports have suggested that Meghan could be considering a Hollywood comeback. But according to PR expert Maya Riaz, if it were true, the couple would never hire Adam Lining. If he is there, then I'm sure we can expect some prominent Hollywood roles. That being said, during her interview with Variety, the Duchess said she was done with acting, telling the interviewer, I guess never say never, but my intention is absolutely not. So what do you guys think about the news? Let us know in the comments, and we'll see you next time for more Raw News and Analysis. Bye for now.